Virtual reality is still very much in its nascent stage, but that hasn't stopped developers from embarking on ambitious personal projects for the sheer novelty of it. One of these involves Rockstar's latest open-world crime drama, Grand Theft Auto B, in first-person mode and with the added touch of VR. Also see, here's why no GTA V single-player The LZ is forthcoming Joseph Delgado, a 21-year-old computer science student from New Jersey, USA is experimenting with transitioning GTA V's lost status into the VR medium, replete with hand tracking for weapons to give it that special touch of realism. But Delgado wasn't too enthusiastic with the results, for reasons unrelated to performance. While underlining that virtual reality is really cool Delgado noted in his initial post on his website, I'm really not sure about this. I feel horrible about making this. You actually feel guilty. My mouth dropped the first time I shot someone in my GTA VR setup. He stressed on the same while conversing with online commenters. I think it's important to talk about the uncomfortable feeling, especially because this is something that might end up on my portfolio in a professional environment, he said, writing under the username Downsider on user Pirate Social News website Reddit. I feel like I'm looking at a crime scene every time I mess with this. It's a serious concern. Other people won't understand until they try it. Also see, PlayStation VR release date will be in late 2016. GameStop CEO There has been no word from Take to Interactive when it plans to support VR for its upcoming or existing ventures. Though the CEO moved away from his initial hesitation with the medium back in 2014. While he labeled the Oculus Rift as antisocial before VR hype took off with audiences, he later said Take Two would be the first in line if that is what consumers want.